and welcome to the programme. The World Health Organization says the number of coronavirus cases worldwide will reach 10 million within the next week. India and China are seeing new flare-ups, but the rise is largely being fueled by the Americas, the pandemic's new epicentre, where the outbreak still hasn't hit its peak. Evelyn Laverick reports. Coronavirus has now caused the deaths of more than 100,000 people in Latin America, over half of them in Brazil. Despite the losses, President Bolsonaro continues to belittle the threat posed by the virus and flouts measures to prevent infections. But 24 hours after a federal judge ordered him to wear a mask when out in public, he was seen wearing one. The number of coronavirus cases around the world is set to reach another infections milestone, according to the World Health Organization. In the first month of this outbreak, less than 10,000 cases were reported to WHO. In the last month, almost 4 million cases have been reported. We expect to reach a total of 10 million cases within the next week. In India, the pandemic has yet to reach its peak. It's recorded nearly 16,000 infections in the last 24 hours, its highest daily spike of new coronavirus cases. In New Delhi, the government has called in the army to manage new treatment centres. The city's deputy chief minister said the priority was to implement policies and facilities that decrease the suffering of people infected but without causing chaos. In the U.S., where a coronavirus resurgence in southern and western states is sending infections to dire new levels, New York, once the epicenter, is telling visitors from there they will have to quarantine for 14 days. If you are violating the quarantine, uh, you can be subject to a judicial order and mandatory quarantine. Uh, you could have to pay the costs of quarantine. There are also fines. And in Beijing, where there's...